Hey everybody, this is Joe with the Over 40 Model Maker here coming at you after a very long time away to go ahead and do another Gunpla review. And today we're just going to jump right to it. And it is the entry grade V Gundam RX-93. Found this at Target the other day, so I picked it up. Uh, quick word of warning, don't get it at Target. Get it online. A lot cheaper. So we'll just go ahead. This is just going to be a quick review here. Because this was a really cool kit. I really don't have anything bad to say about it. So we're just going to go over the positives here. So uh, first we're just going to go around the box here. So here is the front of the box. Side of the box has everything shown. And when they say no tools are required, that is the truth. Most of the time I had my nippers with me. But I could have just nipped one part and then literally just pulled the other two or three or whatever contacting points off the runner and it just came off like that um now granted there were nub marks left behind so you have to clean those up if you want to kind of keep it you know professional but again this is an entry grade uh so it kind of depends on how you want to have your finished product so it's like that. This side, no tools, true, no paint, true, no glue, true. Very good here. So we go around this side. There's only two stickers, and that's it right there. And that right there. And then this side right here. And that's literally it for the box. You get the runners, you get the instructions. That's it. So we'll set that over there. And now it is time for the main event. And it is the figure itself. And I will have to say, this was a really simple build. Very easy. The plastic quality is really good. Everything snaps together great. Um, I mean, this is one of those things where if you can find it really cheap and you want to customize it, you can definitely do that. I, I have nothing bad to say about these entry grades. Just do your research on where you want to, you know, buy these at. Because there are some spots that are really expensive. You know, you can get them maybe $10 cheaper online, depending, you know, where you find it. And have all the other costs around. So, I mean... It's it's a good way of either jumping into the genre of doing these models or if you're a completionist or if you just want a cheap model just to build, just to get your fix. I mean, that's great. You can do that. So um, here you have the front flaps. You have articulations in the leg. In the arms, the wrist, the elbows, the head, we got a little, we got the waist swivel here. Everything is great. Like it. Um, now, if you've ever been following the channel, I also do Warhammer stuff, and I did a goof in Ultramarines, in uh, the Ultramarine blue color. I think what I might do with this, I might go ahead and make this Acadian soldier colors. So that might be a project I can have and show you guys for next time. So with that, this here, two thumbs up. Lovely. I'm going to take off here so you have the rest of your day to go ahead and enjoy. So if it's your birthday, you lovely woman, happy birthday. If it's your birthday, handsome man, happy birthday. We'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Leave a comment down below. Tell me your experience with this. And I will see you guys next time. Later.